Welcome to Grace Place YouTube. Today we're going to be doing a cool science activity and it's called sink or float. So our learning outcome from this activity are going to be making and testing predictions, classifying objects into categories, and also observing and noting details in an experiment. The things you'll need for this experiment is a bin. It could be any type of bin that you have at home and you're going to fill it halfway with water. Then you'll have some plastic figurines of ocean animals just because our theme this week is ocean animals but if you do not have this you can pick some common household items like a sponge a quarter a bottle cap and maybe a spoon um, I do want to remind parents that these are small items so they are hazardous and choking hazards for kids so please just make sure you have adequate supervision during the activity. So you gotta review the term sink or float with your child. So you gotta show them that when something, in order for something to sink, it has to go to the bottom of the water. And in order for something to float, it will stay on the top. So make sure, the whole point of this experiment is for your child to make predictions throughout. Okay, so in order to begin, you're gonna get an object, have your child tell you what the object is, and then you're going to ask them, do you think this will sink or float? All right, let's find out. At this point, you would want them to place it themselves in the water that keeps them engaged. And now we can select a household item, like our quarter, and then you can ask the child again, do you think this will sink or do you think it will float? And then you'll see that the uh, quarter did sink. And then you continue this process with all the other figurines and all the other household items and you know, make, have fun with it. Have your child uh, do it themselves, have them do two at a time. This is just an idea uh, for something to try at home with the kids and you can make it your own and have fun. So thank you so much for watching and we'll see you guys next time.